Hey everyone, happy Tuesday. This is Kyle from Boat Specialist in Ventura, California. And today I am super pumped to share with you guys the newest addition to the Boat Specialist family. Today we're going to be talking about Solara boats. Solara is part of the Fluid Motion series and family, and it is also the sister to Ranger Tugs and Cutwater. The two boats we're going to be going in more detail on are the 250 Center Walkaround and the 250 Dual Console. Both of these boats are 29 feet overall in length and have a ton of premium features that are not found on a lot of its direct competitors. Based out of Washington State, these all-weather, dual-purpose boats come with an array of premium features. Some of the features include both internal and external design elements that allow for your daily boating to be not only more enjoyable, but also more efficient, saving you time and money, which directly correlates to an overall more enjoyable experience out on the water. The Livingston family, who are the founders of Fluid Motion, have spent their entire careers dedicated to making innovative, top-of-the-line boats. I would be so proud to share with you guys some of the features that set Solara apart from its direct competitors. Let's take a look and see what these two boats have to offer. Upon walking up to a Solara boat, one of the first things you'll see is this crazy advanced double step haul. Sometimes you'll see a boat that has one step on the haul. Sometimes you'll see a boat that has no steps on the haul. This boat has two. What that is going to do is it will allow for you to get up onto plane quicker and more efficiently. If we move forward past this crazy haul design, we're going to see these laminar flow interrupters. Think of these as dimples on a golf ball. They are going to increase the amount of suction that you have going around a corner, allowing for greater maneuverability at high speed. Couple that with a bow thruster here in the front, maneuvering, docking, pulling up, moving around becomes super easy and anyone in the family can do it with a Solara. If we get into the nitty gritty here on some of Solara's internal features, we have a foam filled fiberglass stringer and then we also have a bonded electrical system. Cool part about having these details, they translate directly to day-to-day -day usability. And by that, I mean little things such as trailer running lights. These lights are actually integrated into the hull of the boat and they will work in unison with your trailer, increasing safety and usability. If we move backwards here, a huge feature that we're going to see is this clear path swim platform. If you can picture a conventional outboard motor hung and rigged on the transom of a 29-foot boat, there's usually a lot of rigging, components, looms, things to trip on all in this area. What Solara does is they run all of that through this swim platform up here to the back of the motor, keeping it clear and accessible for you to not only utilize this space, but not trip when trying to get on and off the boat. We have trim tabs here that are fully integrated and adjustable. They work in unison with that double stepped hull and everything is powered by a Yamaha 300 horsepower monster. Starting in the stern here, not only does the boat have a fuel capacity of 116 US gallons, we also have an internal fresh water tank that has a capacity of 26 gallons. You have a washout right here. Then you also have a macerated dirty water tank. This black water tank has a capacity of 13 gallons and can be pumped out at your desire. Another thing we have on the back here, ski pylon comes standard, bait tank in here, sink in here, and then up above the boat, we have a six-way rocket launcher, as well as seven separate spots for fishing poles along the gunnels of the boat. If we move forward here, we have seating in the rear that pulls down a seven speaker fusion stereo system, an included cooler, and so many other features that make the day-to-day -day usability and practicality of this boat completely unparalleled. Little things like hard top with built-in integrated lighting, the speaker system, all of it just meshes and flows. Part of the reason why we here at Boat Specialists are super proud to be the newest Solara dealer. And now we're here, we're at the helm, my favorite space on the boat. The electronics package, it comes pretty heavy from the factory. A couple big things to touch on, 8612 SV right out of the box, CL5 for your motors right out of the box, 
Fusion 7 speaker stereo right out of the box. Nowhere are you going to find anything like this. Little things too that are crazy, leather backed dashboard, carbon fiber with red weave, that's straight out of the auto industry. Not anything you're going to find in the luxury boat segment. Other cool features, we have a digital binnacle, which means forward, reverse, going to be a very smooth transition. You don't get the clunk of putting the boat into and out of gear like you would with a mechanical linkage. Bow thruster right here comes standard. Everything else really straightforward. We have adjustable trim tabs, but again, when you couple all of this with the big picture of having a center walk around console, this boat truly is unparalleled. If we take a look at the console over here and what we have in terms of a berth, I think you're going to be absolutely blown away. One of the selling points of the 250CW is this incredibly large and vast berth. This is absolutely huge for a boat of this size. It can accommodate someone up to six feet, two inches tall. Not that I'm going to ever have that issue, but people that are taller will have no issue standing up, sitting down, moving around, and most importantly, going to the bathroom without being uncomfortable or cramped. It's just as if you're using the restroom in your own home, which is really important when you have your family and friends on board the boat. Moving forward on the boat, a big feature you're going to notice are these very high gunnels. This is going to make for a more enjoyable experience, especially if you have small children. Having that peace of mind, knowing that there's not going to be a whoops, is a huge factor for me when it comes to purchasing a boat. Stainless steel all the way around, pop-up cleats, something that is a standard feature with Solara. More rod holders, more cup holders, more larger speakers crazy what you're going to see right here. A second station for your fusion system so you can be the passenger and have complete control of the audio up front. Now if we look at the windlass here, the windlass can be remotely controlled by a passenger and there is also a storage box here to the side. This table can come out and this entire area can become a sunbed. Another thing here, giant windshield wiper. Find me another boat with a big wiper like this. But all of this is absolutely unparalleled compared to my favorite feature of the center walk around. These steps that allow you to access the top of the T-tops. Getting steps like this is usually something you're going to see in the 40, 50, the large big boy boats. But this guy right here, I can climb up super easy get to the top of this T-top, and the T-top here can actually accommodate a roof box like you would have on your car. So you can put your skis, extra storage, whatever it may be, up here on the roof, hop up, grab it, come back down, and you're up and running. And this is something you can do out on the water. For those of you that ski, you'll understand how huge of a benefit point this is. Now we are on the S250 dual console. Please allow me to explain some of the differences between the previous boat and this one. Couple of cool things that we're going to notice is we have extra storage here in the floor. We have a storage box here, bait box here, and this guy's storage that includes the batteries. Here we have a full live well that actually goes down and under. It's pretty substantial. Ski pylon on this guy comes standard on both. Positioning of the sink, grill, and fridge is slightly different on this model. So we have everything off to the side here as opposed to on the other one when it was directly behind the helm. Big point that you're going to really like is the cooler is placed here, but when we get down in here, there is storage galore all the way underneath this day bed. The day bed can be used a few ways. It can be people facing away from each other if you're watching a skier. This can be laid down and it can make a bed the full length or you can have someone facing forward. Talking about skiing here, let me just touch on a point. Normally you need three people to ski. One person doing the skiing, one person driving the boat, one person as a spotter. Solara has done something completely revolutionary. They have put cameras both bow and stern so not only will you be able to pull up an anchor while using the camera, you can also drive the boat and watch your skier, which is really, really fascinating. 
As I'm sure you've started to see, the Solara family comes very heavy with electronics right out of the box. And this boat is no exception. We have our digital binnacle over here. I actually really like the positioning of this one. When you're driving, it makes it super convenient being able to turn or look forward having the side mount binnacle here. Another feature is all Solara boats come standard with autopilot huge expensive option that you would normally have to add after. Your autopilot features are here. Here is that camera we were talking about. You can actually see it. Screens all here. Everything same basic setup as the other boat that we just looked at. But what is going to make this boat truly stand out in its class is this right here. Check out this head and how it is positioned. Discreet, out of the way, yet still large enough for a normal sized person to stand in. There's also a very nifty privacy glass that's here on top of the head. So you can see out, but nobody can see in. The fit and finish is really impressive as well. We have leather backed upholstery here, your compass, the anti-skid mads, anti-skid pads that you can put your phone on. Moving towards the bow, few more standard features that I'd like to touch on for you. Again, second station for the audio, multiple speakers, electric windless second station can be operated by a passenger. This table comes out, can also turn into a day bed, allowing for you just to hang out and chill. Super versatile, the boat does it all. One thing that I am super proud to say is that this boat does not miss anything that you have come to know and expect when purchasing a luxury American-made vessel. We at Boat Specialists are very proud to now be representatives of the Solara family, including Ranger Tugs and everything else under the Fluid Motion umbrella. Hey everyone, it's Kyle. We are back out on the water in the 250 dual console. Super, super excited to show you guys what this boat can do. We're gonna go out, give it a rip, get it up on plane and have some fun. Wow, what can I say? This boat truly amazed me. It was a little bit rougher than we thought it was going to be. We got out there apprehensive at first, but when you hit it, let me tell you something. That double step haul, it got right up on plane. The laminar flow, it was pushing. We had a blast and this boat performed way, way, way better than I thought it was going to. I'm so grateful that I was able to share this experience with you guys and also a little bit about the boat. If you wanna check out this Solara or any of the other ones we have, stop on down to our location, 2900 Golf Course Drive in Ventura, beautiful California. Thank you guys very much.